Good morning, Sunrisers. I'm Dr. Karen Emerson, owner of Emerson Animal Hospital here in West Point, Mississippi. And today I have with me my technician, Mary Parker, and this cute little Jack Russell is Gracie. Gracie is a very, very special story. Gracie presented a few weeks ago just having some diarrhea, not feeling well. Well, we treated that, and then she came back the next week, and the owners noticed that Gracie was urinating pure blood. So I talked to the owner, and I said, we nearly need to do some x-rays of Gracie, check her urine, maybe do an ultrasound. Um, we, we did a urinalysis. Of course, it was hard for us to tell because of all the blood. Then we did an x-ray. Well, on x-ray, I noticed some large objects inside of Gracie. Uh, Gracie's bladder. Um, to go back a little bit, when I, when I called the owners and told them that I'd noticed some objects in Gracie's bladder, they told me that they had noticed that she was kind of going outside and she would tinkle a little, stop, tinkle a little. She was drinking a lot of water. She was acting very painful, uh, really not wanting to be picked up. Um, so after the x-ray, we discovered that Gracie had stones in her bladder, and I'm actually about to show you the actual stones that I took out of uh, Gracie's bladder. Yes, they look like stones you would find out in your driveway, but these are actually struvite stones. And I bet you're all going, what in the world calls these stones? Well, actually what causes stones is actually bacterial infections that cause urinary tract infections and these bacteria that make your pet's bladder sick. I know you've probably had some urinary tract infections yourselves. It can make urease and that causes, it combines with some of the chemicals in the bladder and it slowly forms these stones. And at first when your pet presents, we may see some crystals in the urine and then we'll talk to you about the infection, start your uh, pets on special diets. But this is a very advanced case. I've never seen stones this large and this many in a dog's bladder. So this has probably been going on for a little bit of time. Now Gracie's doing great. I mean, she's like a different dog. She's acting like a puppy again. She's not painful. She actually has to be on a special food now called CD food to keep her pH low enough in her urine so that we can prevent her from forming these stones. And Gracie will, of course, always be checked yearly. Her urine will be checked, and we're going to keep a close eye to make sure this doesn't happen. So if you have a dog at home that's drinking a lot of water, urinating in your home, acting painful, or just off, give us a call, make that appointment. That x ray that we took of Gracie changed her life, and your pets will thank you. I hope you have a great week. WCBI Animal Health with Dr. Emerson was brought to you by Emerson Animal Hospital in West Point.